One sucker. No one. We're live streaming. Well, <laughs> no, he had two, but I don't think AJ wanted to. How did you put? Did you hide it in your sleeping We're live streaming. Ah. Oh, I'm sorry. Um. Uh, Good morning, good morning, good good afternoon, good afternoon, good afternoon. This is Jeremiah's J-Man Monero with J-Man Seminars. We're obviously having a lot of fun here in the office. Uh, I hit the live button. I'm on vlive.tv going live now instead of Facebook because I couldn't figure out how to share my screen. And so I went to vlive.tv because I know how to share my screen on there. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Staten, for welcoming me back. So can you see my screen? Please comment below. I just want to be sure because what I'm going to do now is live, show everybody how to brand up their videos. I'm going to come over here, and I use a program called Movavi Video Suite. Um, so sweet. Sweet. You know, it's always great after you live stream. Ah! If you don't know what we're talking about, uh, we've been going live on YouTube for a little while. Uh, Go head over to our YouTube channel. It's youtube.com slash J Man Speaks. And every but, time we say live stream, we have to go. Ah, ah, yeah. Every time we say live stream, that's the word of the day. Ah, <laughs> we have to say say something, but let me just we'll I want to pick the, the best. Ah, no, I want I don't want that. Oh, one. I want this one. Okay. So I'm coming back here. One second. I'm going to go to Movavi Video Editor, and what you want to do is just upload. I'm going to add a media file. I'm going to find a random video that I have. Let's see what it is. What it is! What it be like! How does the Movavi Video Oh, yeah. Video Let's do work? this one. How okay. do we use it? How do we use it? Yeah. Uh, so, really basic. I'm just, right now, I'm uploading a video. This is a video, I think, of... People doing the Kiki Challenge at the Long Island Tech Fair. If you don't it's, know what the Kiki Challenge is, watch that video. Yeah, go. Kiki, Kiki, Kiki love me. Oh, you right. Okay, don't distract me. Nope. Um, if you're watching, uh, Facebook.com slash Jman Speaks. So here we're on, we have the video, and this is a great video that has a high chance of virality, or a lot of people would share, comment, oh, engage. Um, it just went viral. viral. And so what we do then, I'm gonna add a media file here. And for the media file, I'm just gonna look for my logo, J Man logo. And it, it really wouldn't matter whether it's a video logo or a JPEG or a PNG. You see how it adds it after the video itself. If I take the logo and I drag it over my video, so now they're one on top of the other. These are different layers of video. And so I'm gonna click on that. If I left it the way it is, it would cover my entire video. I don't want that. I'm gonna double click it. I am gonna reduce it in size. Like this. Now you don't want it to be too annoying, like too big. But I like to put it right in the center. That green line tells me it's right in the center of my video. Okay. Now if I hit apply, I'm gonna want to make sure this yellow line tells me the length, how long that photo is gonna stay in the video. So I'm gonna take it, I'm just gonna drag it the entire length of the video. So now it's all the way through. Okay, now you can see. Okay. All right, now let's say I want to take it one step further. Having the logo on there is one piece, but I also want to add my website. So I'm going to go, I like the fly in. I'm going to heart that. That's one of my favorites. And these you just click and drag. And click and drag it. So again, this is another layer. This is a text layer. I'm going to add the text, double click it, and I'm going to do www.jmanseminars.com. Okay, and it asking any questions over there? Yeah? Well, if you see any questions, let me know so I can answer them. 
uh, jmanseminars.com. If, if it's long like this and there's it comes out a little goofy, just lengthen it out like that. Bring it down. Okay. Okay. Again, that green line tells me I'm in the center. Outline will help you with the legibility of it. You can see how that's a black outline. My colors are like gray, white, and like this dark blue here. So I try to stay in line with my, my color scheme. Okay, you see that makes it a little bit better. And if I, you control how long it stays in the video. So if I wanted to again do the whole thing, so it's there, whoops, it's there the entire time. I like that. Wait, wait. What? We're live streaming, right? Ah! <laughs> I don't love that, everyone. Oh, about the emails. So what happens there, like... Okay, now here's, here's the flying effect. It's a little glitchy because we're streaming and we're, we're sharing the screen. Uh, but you kind of get the idea. Because we're live streaming? Ah! <laughs> All right, and so I'll show you this one last thing before we stop it. If you want to see the transition between the two videos, because I'm putting two videos together, it automatically stitches it together, but the transition is like it's just really abrupt and not very professional. I want to blur it in, go like that. Now you see the difference. Whoops. So what happens there? Like okay, and then the last thing I would probably do as far as effects are concerned, see when you're on these puzzle pieces, these are always transitions. I'm going to go fade, and I'll go fade to black over here. Put that on the end, and that gives us a nice professional fade to black. Okay. Like we can do that. It looks good instead of instead of like covering up your camera. But if you cover up your camera, it's not very professional. Now it looks like you're covering up your camera if you do the blackout. Right, it, and it gradually fades it to black. And at the same time, you want to go into your audio, the audio portion. If you click on the bottom audio portion there, you click these. It has a fade out as well, so that the audio doesn't just cut. You know, you fade to black, you want your sound to also fade away like this. All right. <laughs> See that? Nice and professional. I'm done. I'll go file, save movie as a media file, name it, and then you're done. Boom. Video? Boom. I hope everybody could see that. Yep. Okay. Now I'm going to... If you're watching us, um, All right. So again, this is Jeremiah's J Man Monero. Uh, Patty Hurtado. Nice to meet you. Uh, the software is Movavi, Movavi Video Suite. I'm going to put it in the comments below here. Not the comments, the description. No, I have the I have comments over there. We'll put it in the description of that one. Um, it's Movavi Video Suite. It's a one time purchase. You don't have to pay for any licensing fee every year, so that's why I like it. It's super easy, super intuitive. I try to post uh, tech tips every once in a while with just one thing. So if you start using it and you're like, hey, how do you do this? Like somebody reached out and said, how do I add a logo to my video? I'm like, all right, that'll be a good tech tip for me to do because there's probably a lot of people that are wondering how to do that. Uh, Jeff, we did get snow. How many? How much snow did we get? A couple feet? 15? Inches. 15 oh, yeah. inches. It seemed like more. A, quarter, a, foot and three a little more in other a foot. areas. Yeah, a little yeah. more in other areas. Um, I guess that's all for now, folks. Again, hope you're having a great week. If you're in the greater capital region, make sure to come check me out this Wednesday, the 23rd, from 6 to 9 p.m. We're going to be at the Blue Bistro, I believe. It's right across from the Desmond. Uh, we're going to be doing Social Media Mastery. And more. So make it a great day. Thanks for tuning in. Bye. All right, everybody. Yeah. You got the behind the scenes action.
uh, of me going live. We didn't even know what we were going to go live ahead of time, uh, but we did it. We had some issues. But guess what? When it comes to video, there's always going to be some kind of problem. There's always going to be times where you go live and make a mistake. Like I did, I went live and then I couldn't share my screen using the Facebook app or the Facebook program because it's, it's awful. But I knew how to do it with the live at TV. So I was like, okay, there's always a work line as long as you stay calm. And, and just remember that if you're going live, you could always just pause it, stop Wait, it. Did you say live stream? I said live stream! Ah! 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 Uh, and really, oh, you know what? I didn't.